Hey, War Pugs. So, every Friday night, I have a stream I call Shanigans, and uh, people request videos to be watched, things like that. And sometimes somebody requests something that's a little bit longer than I normally will watch during that time period, because normally with Shanigans, I try to keep it under four minutes. Oh, sorry, under three minutes. Don't even know my own rules. But um, this one in particular was requested. This is New Breed featuring Jesse Howard. This is Welcome to My House. It has a lot of views. I've never heard of this before. I don't think I've ever... Well, I, I know I've never listened to anything by uh, New Breed or anything like this. So this is the first time I've ever heard of them. Um, we're going to check them out. See what's up, see what this is about, um, guys. I am. We are. I finally made a dent today in the boxes for the move-in, so I'm kind of a little bit worn out. <laughs> but uh, eventually, I'm going to have the mantelpiece filled up back there. I've got. I still got all the stuff that was in the old office that I need to get. Um, I need to get shells, all this other kind of stuff. Check the links in the description down below. Um. Yeah, let's just get into it. Here we go. New Breed featuring Jesse Howard. Welcome to my house. Let's go. You can believe what happened over here, man. Yeah. We're going out there and we're going to the house. Come on, just taking out the garbage. Where you been? Shit, man. I've been taking care of these motherfuckers. Okay. Oh, okay. Okay, I this is my country. This is who I am. This is who I am. So welcome to my house. I didn't expect that voice to come out of him. I didn't expect I didn't I don't I didn't know what to expect out of this period. So welcome to my house. Yeah, wrong one. Shotgun in your mouth. Shotgun in your mouth. I'm glad 
you brought your friends they can watch you go down watch you go down i got no Ohio. so welcome to my house welcome to my house cuz these are my people Is this the new age? Is this the new age's free bird at this point? So welcome to my house. I got a baby girl inside this house, and right now she's sound. Sleep, so it's probably best for the both of us if you just turn around and leave. Cause if you come in this fucking house, then you too gonna go to sleep. I promise you, boy, don't play with me. I pray to God my soul to keep. Especially this day and age, gotta handle shit our own way. With a 30 30 or 12 gauge behind this door, you're hella weight. My old lady, she rides too, picking up every shell case, mopping up these blood stains, but she ain't seen a damn thing. Most of the convicts, hard headed, no nonsense. So please approach with caution You never know who's watching You never know what's on the other side of that front door And you knocking Might step out like Motherfuckers get the dropping All the neighbors heard was the dogs barking The sun was down, it was getting dark And I told the sheriff it ain't no problems Man, I was just taking out the garbage So if you don't mind, please excuse me I'm with the family trying to watch a movie I'm sure you got better things to do So I'll let you go and get back to do it Y'all just need to stop knocking on that door. So welcome to my house. <laughs> Lord have mercy. 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 So welcome to my house. <laughs> Why'd you even Lord open the door? So welcome to my house. <laughs> Lord have mercy. Lord have mercy. Why even open the door? Lord have mercy. Lord have mercy. So welcome to my house. Lord have mercy. I ain't heard nothing. Uh, ain't nothing going on around here. I just got the kids in the house and stuff like that. We're just hanging out, having a good old time. Gotcha. <coughs> yeah, man. That's it. Sounds good to me. All right, y'all take it easy. Have a good night, man. You too, man. <laughs> you hear the guy in the background. Okay, so this is the... I I'd say this is the anthem for anybody who 
lives out in the country because in a lot of like when when me and when me and the hospitaler lived out in the country at one point we had uh we had a we had an incident at our house and um when the police came they said if they if they're on your property if they're like she's in here sitting down looking at me right now uh, but they when you were in the country where do you think we are now you shut up <laughs> but it was pretty much if they're if they're on your property if they if their foot's on your property you can blast them back off of it but just make sure they land on it well, out here there's they gotta be across the threshold i know woman i know but you better believe they cross that threshold and i shoot them i'm dragging their ass across <laughs> Don't that this will eventually be used in the court of law. I know, this, this this will eventually be used in the court of law. Probably. But um Why'd you shoot that guy with a bow and arrow? I'm telling you what, like I you don't have to worry about it with me because I you'll just you'll just lights will go out. This creature on the other hand do you realize she bought a whole tactical kit one time with tomahawks? <laughs> tomahawks. I don't understand her. Uh, crossbow, tomahawk. <coughs> crossbow, tomahawks, that, recurve bow. Weapon with the chain and the ball, spiky ball. Here? Yeah, she has a flail. She has a. F <laughs> she has a ball and chain. My ball and chain has a ball and chain. Ain't that something? <laughs> but yeah, this is um. Well, a couple of things. First, I didn't expect like I didn't expect it to be actually as you know. First off, the song is good. The song is good. One second. So this song really does speak to like a demographic that will not hear this type of music speak to him that often, and it speaks like very specifically to people who will def like there are there are people who will defend their house their family and they will like i mean they may feel regret over it but it'll happen it will happen there are over for anybody like and i understand that i understand firearms and things like that are a hot button issue i watch a lot of things about I watch a lot of things from GunTube. I really, really like GunTube. Um, Kentucky Ballistics, Demolition Ranch, all that kind of stuff. I really, really enjoy those. But at the end of the day, um, firearms stop so many home invasions, so many uh, so many assaults, everything like that. Um, so, yes, you know, as, as apolitical as I am, I mean, just know that I do support the Second Amendment massively because i read this i've read the statistics i've read all well i i know all i know all the points and the counterpoints but at the same time um there are two statements that i just kind of live by one no one should ever have to like if somebody breaks into my house i don't i'm never going to live in a state where they tell me that I have to retreat in the face of that. I have to, I have to retreat from that. I have to fall back from that. They now, they now are in my house and can do whatever they want to. But I have to, I have to watch out for them. I have to blah blah blah. No, I'm never going to live in a state that asks me to be a victim. I'm never going to do that. And the second thing is for every woman out there, God made man and woman. Colt, the Colt 45 made men and women equal. So, like, y'all stop it. <sighs> Aside from that, though, um, God, like, my train of thought is being interrupted like six ways for Sunday because, you know, I got the dogs barking upstairs. I got her sitting right there. But... I'm just imagining my crossbow and a wooden spoon. Stop. Would you stop it? <laughs> Would you stop it? <laughs> Creepy. What? I slept when, when we... 
We lived in this. We lived in this one part. Of, we lived in this one area that was sketchy. I slept with a 1911 by my side, like in in my um in my um nightstand. What does she have? She had a hatchet, a long blade knife, and this one thing that I can't even like. It, it, I don't know. Well, you had a Glock, but you never put you you had the Glock in the you had the Glock in the closet. Yeah, but I own one. You had the Glock in the closet. I'm creative, I don't need a gun. You had throwing knives in the. I don't. Most I mean, I'm probably whitest. Not accurate with the throwing knives, with somebody a lot of people are with guns. Whitest woman I know carries the weirdest arsenal. I don't understand her. Um, four foot eleven or kick your ass. Fuck you up, bitch. Stop talking. War I'm gonna head out from here. Um, as far as I'm concerned, send me more stuff like this. Send me more stuff like this. Um, the music video was kind of the music video was kind of campy because I'll tell you this. First off, um. Ain't no worrying about opening the door before you do what you get before you do what you do. And uh running down a guy with an ATV that's got a sucking chest wound, that ain't happening. I'm just saying, you ain't gonna have to run him down for long. I'm just saying. Ain't no need for the ATV. Warpugs, I'm gonna head out from here. Thank you for sending this. Thank you for requesting this. Um and yeah. Send me more stuff like what? Thank you, thank you. I was talking. Stop talking about wrangling people. What is your problem? What is your problem? Oh, I have so Most men say their woman is crazy. I have paperwork to back up my claims. Do you? Later, Warpugs. Check the links in the description down below. Like and subscribe. I will catch you guys next time.